Greetings everyone. So I've been looking at this PlayStation 5 that's about to hit the streets. So I was wondering how much would it cost to get the system itself and all the additional accessories that Sony has to offer. Stick around because I'm going to go over all the accessories, their costs, how much all those accessories cost together and the total package with the system and all the accessories all in one. Okay, so let's start off with the systems. You got two offerings here. One that's a little bit less, that doesn't have the optical drive, but I would rather get the one with the optical drive, and that one is coming in at $499.99. Now, if you want to play with someone else beside yourself, you know, you might have other family members in your house, you're gonna need a second controller because this system only come with one controller. So for a second controller, that's gonna cost you another $69.99. And while we're talking about controllers, because these controller has a built-in battery, a rechargeable battery that is, you're gonna need some way of charging them. Yes, there's a USB-C cable that you can attach to it and plug it into a wall and charge them up. But if you wanna charge them both together, you're gonna to need this charging dock. And this charging dock is coming in at $29.99, which will make it easy for you to neatly charge each one of those controllers instead of having them strung up on the wall or on the floor to charge them up. Now, if you wanna have that seclusive sound coming into your ear without you blasting the TV, depending on how your house is set up, you might not wanna be blasting the TV to disturb others. Then you're probably gonna opt for the wireless headphones to go along with the system, which is coming in at $99.99. And the next piece of additional hardware accessory that you might wanna consider is the camera. And that camera is coming in at $59.99. And of course, if you're going to consume media on your PlayStation 5, like Netflix, you probably want to pop a Blu-ray DVD inside the slot so you can watch the movies that you already have. So to have that home theater style experience, you're going to need the media remote. Although you can navigate around by using the PlayStation controller, you probably want to get the media remote. And that media remote is going to cost you $29.99. All right, so that's all the accessories that Sony is offering with the PlayStation 5. And the total cost for all those accessories by themselves is going to run you $289.95. Now, the cool thing about these additional accessories by Sony is they all have the same style and design as the PlayStation 5. So the whole package will blend nicely together. Okay, so now let's get the cost of all the accessories and the system in one bundle. So that grand total price is going to hit you for $789.94. So there you go, folks. So if you have the money to splurge and you want to get the system and all the accessories that Sony has to offer, this is what it's going to cost you. Now, you can always opt for additional accessories from different manufacturers because I'm pretty sure there will be third-party accessories by different manufacturers that will work with the PlayStation 5. But you already know that those accessories are not gonna have that same style and decor as the PlayStation 5. So if that's not a factor, then yes, you can probably find accessories that cost a whole lot less. But if you're trying to blend everything together to have that same look and style, then this is what it's gonna cost to go down that road. All right, so that's gonna wrap up this video. Thanks for watching, have a good one, and I'll see you next time.